Are you landlocked? Nowhere near an ocean or a beach? You want to experience one? Come with me today and experience the Canaveral National Seashore. Live vicariously through Turkish on the Trail. Enjoy the beauty this park has to give us. Good morning. Just made it to Canaveral National Seashore. Yeah, didn't have to pay a cent to get in here because I got one of these National Park Passes. Uh, kind of got it free. Life. It's a good thing to be a disabled veteran. I'm still trying to find a parking space. However, on my way up, I happen to uh, encounter that sign right there. I'll blur out anything if I do find any. Oh, just arrived at the very last parking lot, right at the end of the uh, the drive after you get into the park. There are some restrooms there, but I don't believe there's any running water. So, sure to bring water if you're coming out here. Not even two minutes on the beach, and I've already ran into my first nudists. I just passed the uh, point of no return where it says you need a uh, permit to be in the backwoods. And I'm really hoping to actually start doing some trails if possible, but I don't want to disturb the turtle nests. All those little yellow uh, sticks that you see back there along the dunes, those are all where uh, turtles have come up, laid their eggs, and they're protected. And I don't want to step on any turtles' babies. You know what I'm talking about. So far I've gone a couple miles, can't find any trailheads. I was told there might be some trailheads and trails out here, but in the meantime, enjoy these gorgeous views on the beach. What do we have here? That's a pretty shell. So there was supposed to be this place called the Klondike Trail. Haven't found it unless it is actually walking on the beach itself. However, I'm not complaining because this is gorgeous. Oh. So I just chatted with the National Park Service folks right over there. They're over there checking in on all these turtle nests. And I found out not all the nests are actually stakes because they ran out of stakes. So there's probably way more than the hundreds of uh, yellow stakes that you see out here. A ranger came back and stopped me. He goes, hey, here's some uh, trivia for you. Just to let you know, this Canaveral National Seashore, second biggest turtle population for nesting out of the national parks. That's your bit of bar trivia for the day.
Yeah. And guess what? I talked to them and they said there used to be a trail out there behind the dunes, which is very buggy and kind of uh, not as picturesque as this right here. However, due to a couple of hurricanes, that trail is no longer there. My shoes are soaking wet and so are my socks because I walked too close to the edge. Oh well. Oh no. Okay. My feet are definitely wet now. Oh, it feels good. It took me miles and miles, but no more uh, no more naked people everywhere on the beach. Just those two rangers that are down there checking on the sea turtles. I feel like I've been playing leapfrog with those uh, park rangers. Seems like I'll catch up to them. They do their thing. They take off on their ATVs. It's quiet. I creep up on them again. They take off on their ATVs. So, got about five miles now, and the scenes that you've seen are pretty much what it is on this entire beach. After you pass mob of naked guys. Times like this remind me of a movie called The Beach. It stars Leonardo DiCaprio. And uh, such a beautiful beach. This one doesn't look anything like the one in Thailand, but it's still good for the soul. I ended up having to take off my shoes and socks. They had more sand in them than the beach did. Yeah, more news that showed up since I started. And all the way down there is very, very full now. I don't think I'll video over there just for their uh, privacy. Plus it might seem kind of kooky if I'm over there recording them. Well, pass through the uh, nudist tanning portion of the beach. It quadrupled, if not pentupled, its size from when I took off earlier. And then I got off the beach. There's no running water out here to wash off your feet or uh, take a shower. All in all, it was a, a unique day. I really enjoyed the beach after about a mile or so. It's more scenic. <laughs> However, the first uh, half mile was more all natural. Excuse the fun.